So it got me thinking, am I actually the richest player in Beast Swarm right now? I mean, I've got literally everything in the game except for the planter of plenty. And wow guys, I don't have a lot of honey, but I have a lot of resources. So let's go claim the hive and uh, you guys can tell me if you think you're richer in Beast Swarm Simulator. So let's go to the inventory, do an inventory check and see exactly how we're going here. Now I've got 5 trillion honey. Now I know you can get on the leaderboard guys, I could do that too, right? I just get a few bees, swap my bees out, and do some macroing. I mean, that is not even fun for me, but that doesn't mean you're a rich player. It just means you basically had your computer running a long time. So, yeah, the way I consider a rich player is someone who's actually got a lot of resources. Because, well, obviously they played the game a lot, and they score some great items when killing mobs and what have you. So, guys, let's go and check my inventory out and see exactly if I am the richest player in Beast Swarm Simulator. I certainly think I am amongst the YouTubers that's for sure let's go and have a look here 5970 tickets what that's pretty decent i spent a lot of tickets during beastmas i did have nearly 13,000 before beastmas started so that was pretty cool yeah the big quip case let's go have a look at the big quips yeah they're all just pretty standard big quips guys i pretty much got all the best B quips as well. Uh, gumdrops, I've only got 3,800. Oh, I feel really bad. It's only 3,800. But uh, yeah, that is a lot of gumdrops, guys. Now, I've only got uh, 499 coconuts because I think I used one. What? Oh, okay. That's insane. You guys probably have more. I've got 15 converters. Oh, boy. I'm going to use these things. I've got 2,000 honeysuckles. What? That's enough for two turpentines. Well, that's amazing. i got some whirly gigs. That's and I got 1,300 field dice. Yeah, 1,373 field dice. I got 272 smooth dice. What? I got 25 loaded dice. That's the max I can have, so I can't even craft anymore. I've got 100 jelly beads. I've only got a few extracts of red, and I've got 325 blue because, well, I got the blue tide popper, and I got the gummy baller, and I got the dark scythe. Wow, I spent all my extracts in that, that way. Glitter, only 780. 80 guys oh i feel really bad it's only 780 glitter and only 136 glue let's change that now in case someone had 137 i got 141 glue and as i said guys i've bought all this stuff in the shop anyway so let's go and equip something and make it look amazing because everyone says oops why don't you have your tide popper and why don't you have your gummy ball around in that and i say well you know i actually like the pedal one it isn't laggy right it doesn't lag all right so let's keep on going here guys i got like uh, oil i got 1379 oil beat that okay 474 enzymes now i used a bunch of enzymes i can't remember i had to craft a whole bunch of caustic waxes and stuff that cost me a lot uh, i've only got 1426 tropical drinks but you know guys i've got three purple potions yeah they that's expensive i had to get a whole heap of super smoothies really quickly so i could get all of the end game dippers yeah that's right so that cost me a lot see that ball on the top that makes this bit laggy because it's like another bee running around trying to follow the end of your dipper so yeah as you can just saw there guys it glitches a little bit when you're sort of using it and whatever so yeah that could probably change uh anyway i've only got seven uh, marshmallow bees which is pretty decent because you can't even get them so that's pretty all right uh, i've got 319 magic beads so i used about 400 magic beads literally to get these in-game items because well i needed to get the extracts and they just took a lot so i've got 11 festive beads that's pretty decent i've only got eight cloud vials and i've got 11 night bells in case i ever need to summon it's night time but it comes around every 10 15 minutes so i don't really care uh boxo frogs i've got 14 out of 15 i could totally use that but i got myself like 12 tadpole bees so why would i bother i've got nine ad passes so i should go and collect one of them really soon uh, I've also got uh, some ridiculously big number of treats. Now, I've got these treats. So that's 12 million treats, guys. I got the treats from doing post rooms. Pretty much, that's where I'm getting them from. I'm not even buying them. Let's equip the Dark Scythe. We can see what that looks like as well while we're chatting away. So, yeah, I've got that. I've even got a Star Treat, guys. Wow, I don't even use it for some reason. I don't know. Not everything is gifted on my hive, so I don't know why I don't use my Star Treat. But, look, I'll use it for a special thing i could use my blueberries to get these guys turned into gifted but i got enough gifted anyway what that's insane uh i could i've got 30 atomic treats what
what? That's insane as well. How did I even get those? I've got 219 gingerbread. Can you believe that, guys? I've literally bought everything out of the catalog. There it is, guys. I bought everything out of the catalog, and I've still got 219 gingerbread. Let's see if there's any more here waiting for me. Oh, another 16, guys. So I've got 235 gingerbread as well. So that is pretty cool, guys. I've got 61,000 sunflower seeds, so if I need more oil, well, I can go and craft those. I've got 9,425 strawberries, 22,597 pineapples, and, uh, well, I've got 6,113 blueberries so that's called cool. no 16 blueberries it's easy this game is easy let's just quickly get in here and get some more resources because everything has just changed now let's look at the bitter berries guys 26,809 bitter berries what the seriously where did I even get these from they're coming from basically the mondo chick and also now from the puffs room so that's pretty cool as well I've even got 200 neil berries and I use them all to go and craft the dark scythe because I needed to get caustic waxes and everything. So that's crazy. That's the tide popper. That's amazing as well. But like, I don't really like how when you walk, well, when I walk, it's like jittering around. So that annoys me. Uh, I'm going to have to fix that with my walk animation, but I'm going to do that at some stage. I've only got 10,388 moon charms. That's insane, guys. Let's go and spend another bunch of moon charms right now because I haven't fully maxed that out. Now, you want to do this on a regular basis as well, guys. What? Oh, just made it. All right, you want to do this on a regular basis because it is going to give you something better. Now, max in the capacity. Uh, wow, I don't really want... Well, actually, yeah, maybe I don't want Bond from Treats right now. Instant conversion is pretty good. And I'm getting some extra white pollen, so let's replace it. I'll just spend another 100 next time. Uh, I've got three pink balloons, 12 uh, red, eight white balloons. No black balloons because I used them when I was grinding honey. Now on the waxes, guys, I've got 787 soft waxes, and I used a bunch, guys. I have used a lot of soft waxes. I've probably had several thousand soft waxes. Uh, I've got 51 hard waxes, 1 caustic wax, and 10 swell wax. Well, it's because I bought everything, so now I'm kind of waiting for the next thing I have to do and uh, buy that as well. So let's just get rid of this spider here. And, uh, yeah, well, so that's that's it, guys. Oh, I've only got one paper plant. I could totally go buy those if I wanted to. 22 ticket planters. I've got all the planters. I've got eggs. Let's talk eggs, guys. Let's talk eggs. I've got six gold, seven diamond, ten mythic eggs. What? And I've got one star egg. What? And I've got one gifted gold egg. Three gifted diamond? Seriously? What if you could buy a diamond mask with gifted diamond eggs? And I've got three gifted mythic eggs. What? This is insane, guys. That is insane. Surely I am the richest player in the whole of Beast Form Simulator. Let me know if your inventory is better than mine. So now I've got 25,000 royal jellies. I've also got 426 star jellies, which is not bad because I did use a bunch for crafting. So there is that, guys. I've got six bumblebee eggs. Where did they even get them from? Like, seriously, I've got bumblebee jelly, haste bee jelly, rad bee jelly. I've got rascal bee eggs. I've got bumblebee eggs. I've got exhausted bee jellies, fire bee jelly, frosty bee jelly, honey bee jelly, rage bee jelly, baby bee jelly, diamond bee jelly, music bee jelly, fuzzy bee eggs. What? I've got a fuzzy bee egg. I've got a precise bee egg as well. Oh, what? This is going to be amazing, guys, if I ever want a precise bee, which I don't want, really. Uh, yeah, because it's more lag. And uh, basically, I've got some other jellies for the rest of the event bees. So that is my inventory, guys. Let me know in the comments below whether you think you've got a better inventory than Hoops the Bee. Uh, I'm ready. I'm ready on it. I'm ready for the update. Let's see what you got. Let's bring out those extra planters and see what that's going to cost me. But Hoops has got this covered already. And the key to have an amazing inventory like this is just keep playing. Even if Onnit doesn't update the game, just keep playing every day. Just do five or ten minutes here and there. And you'll get a whole heap of resources as well. Anyway, guys, that's all got time for today. Please like and subscribe. And until next time, it's bye for now. Thank you.